Hello everyone, welcome to my Unreal Engine tutorial series on how to create an open world game. So this time I'm going to fix this uh, jerky moment of this AI character. So as you can see, when I, whenever my character, player character appears in, uh, in his view area, he's trying to reach us but he's kind of jerking and not really directly coming to us so that happens because of this uh, the problem in this go to location method i have written in ai human class so today i'm going to fix it now in here first thing i should do is so this character uh, continues to call this go to location method uh, in each time this uh, perception updated event is called so first i should prevent that because uh, this character should not uh, if that happens then that is the reason to have this jerking moment because each time this update method is called from inside this function I will get some random point and this AI character will try to the reach that random point in point in this radius and because of the changing in this point he will kind of jerk right so let's fix it first thing is uh, first thing i'm going to do is i'm going to prevent this method calling more than once if already there is some execution going on in this area so i can do it like this i'm going to add a do once node here and so what this do once node does is uh, it will call execute up to this point but it wouldn't uh, execute after this point more than once until this reset is called so I'm going to call the reset only if this movement is success right and the next thing is I'm going to define a variable called destination so this is going to be the destination of this go to location method destination of the AI character right now first I'm gonna call AI move to location function and as the destination I'm not going to get any target location or anything I just directly put it here and uh, not this one AI move to this one right and as the target I'm gonna go this and yes on success I'm gonna plug it here and on fail I'm gonna plug it here right now let's see if this works let's go to the did you did you, didn't he see you? let's start from here oh wait I need to check this part. 
right no problem in this area I didn't make any changes here okay let's go around like this okay he saw me and yeah it's not fixed so what can we do maybe instead of using move to locate AI move to location I should try this target actor so how can I do that I can promote this to a variable I'll call it enemy alright yes enemy and not get let's try that without using this function maybe right here so later fix that go to location function uh, integrate this uh, thing into the go to location function first let's check if that works so yeah first I'm going to do is what I'm going to do is check if this is an enemy I'm going to set this with the not here with this reference right and I'm going to do this only once for each enemy character so for that I have to check if this one or this new enemy character is uh, not equal to this one to the enemy character that I already have so this this should be true and this also should be true in order to execute this part and after this part I'll disconnect this section for now and I'll use AI move to actor maybe let's use this one AI move to and as for the target actor I'll give this one let's see what happens now starting from here and let's go into the site area of the yeah uh, well not exactly he's still kind of jerking around let's try the other function uh, maybe the problem is we have this destination as well here move to actor right but here the problem is we don't have a way to check if we have already reached the target well no it's not working why is that maybe I sh should 
debug this. Did I do something wrong here? Not decorant. And Okay, so I found the problem what causes this navigation to not work properly. So if I enable Navi if I would show navigation command here you can see the navigation data and as you can see here some area around this character this navigation becomes unavailable. So this uh, this is the reason to make this character run around like this so this happens actually this is quite unexpected i didn't thought something like this would happen so anyway the reason for this is that we have added this assembled glimmer that means this one into a character we added this uh, after we working on NPC world navigation and everything and this component and this component uh, this uh, by default it has enabled this uh, can ever affect navigation so this is enabled so this is the reason to make that navigation area block so when I uncheck that I'll show you that uh, navigation blocking is removed yeah like this and where is our AI character now let's go to our AI character. Maybe he didn't see us. I don't know. Let's try again. Okay? Right now let's go to him. And yeah, as you can see, he's coming to us. Actually, he's going to the, our previous last seen location. Well, that's that can be fixed, but whenever i go into his vision area yeah he's coming to me without any jerky moment so right so yeah that's all for today so now we have fixed that problem we had with navigation and in the next time let's work on something like when I go into the area of the visible area of this character, he is coming to me and he start attacking. So kind of like a simple fight. Alright. See you in the next video. Goodbye.